our goal is to have a better house than the one we have now because obviously, I mean, there's not really much going on with it. It's just pretty fucking ugly. It looks like, it looks kind of like Queen Elizabeth a little bit. No, no offense, obviously, you know, she died recently, but um, um, as you can see, I've cut some of my trees down, some of my jungle trees. I think there's still a plank in that because the leaves haven't despawned. I'm about to cut this giant one right here, and I'm going to go plant some more of these jungle saplings in that open area over there, and we can get the building. We collected about a stack of wood from there, and jeez, 10, 10, God, yeah. but what the hell? 10 saplings. Get out of my way, bro. Let me live. Okay, so I just remembered what well, I realized. I'm, I'm gonna need the leaves to make the artificial tree. So I think I should be good with one shears. Bro, I'm about to have the most beautiful base that you guys have ever seen. I always thought that shit's gonna be hideous. We missed one block. I don't know if it's just like a really faint memory, like a fever dream or something, but was there a point in Minecraft where like when you would take the dirt block out from under the tree, it would like rot or something? Like it would, like the tree would die? I don't know if that, I, maybe that was just something from like Pocket Edition or something that I dreamed of or something. Does anybody remember that? Or is that just like, am I going crazy? I'm gonna outline kind of like the, the base of the tree. I'm wondering though, like if I should include this part in here or if I should leave it like on the outside. It really depends on what I could use it for though. So this is gonna be our base. Not sure how to feel about where to put the entrance. Cause I feel like I could go over there, but I also need to come over here sometimes. But I mean, I could just go around or I can make like a back entrance. I mean, I live on the top of a hill and if I go, like my backyard is a steep drop. Like I'll die if I go in my backyard. So maybe not. I'm, I'm gonna make the entrance over here is like the best option. This is gonna be the entrance. So, now to do all the mathematics for this. So this shit grew with no base. I think that's part of this tree. Yeah, that's part of this tree. Um, I had to make another pair of shears because this, this one's about to break. But I don't think I'm gonna need all these leaves, honestly. I might need some of the vines. I'm, okay. I'm gonna need maybe a couple of them. I don't want to use too many vines because I feel like it's going to take away from the natural tree look. God, no! <gasps> Yo, bro, this cre these creepers, bro. These mobs are just waiting on me, bro. They're plotting. And the last piece. Done. We're done, bro. Actually, I lied. There was a hundred more trees after this, but I took a break from cutting down trees and I went to go explore. I found a village. And there was a blacksmith with a temple like built into it and I looted it. Had some pretty good loot. Uh, found some melons and a broken portal. Then I got back to work. <sighs> this, this is a lot, man. I don't, I don't, I don't even, I don't even know. This is what we got so far. It ain't much, but it's honest work. I need to trim these vines too, but not right now. I'm still kind of struggling a little bit with what to do on the inside. Cause like, what do I really need on the inside? I made that couple days ago um when i took a break from from building the, the, the tree house and i was gonna make a video on it but it just it wasn't working out it was so complicated like i said before i can't follow tutorials for the life of me but i, I think it works um i don't have any bone meal to use to like see if it actually works so i'm gonna have to wait until everything grows out and then i'll demonstrate it but i just i, I couldn't do a video on it i do i need, I need some dirt though that used a lot of dirt and I, I have no dirt now. Now I don't think I even told y'all that I was gonna make a tree house like before this video. I don't think y'all were informed on this decision, but next time I do some shit like this, please stop me. Cause what the, what the hell? I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm just really going off the dome right now. All right, let's try something like this. Bro. <laughs> Bro. What is this? Do I, do I extend it more? Like, 
Bro, I'm gonna need so much more wood. Oh, sh okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm. I'm stressed. I don't, I don't know what to do. This is so messy. I just. What was I thinking? You know what? Maybe it won't look so bad. At least from the edges. The edges don't look too bad. I mean, they they might need some work here and there, but not looking too bad right now. We getting somewhere. We can watch the view from up here. We can watch the sunset. I'm gonna paint a sunset myself. This doesn't work out, and I can't get back now. Oh yes, I can. I almost, I almost died there, but I need, I need it, I need it, I need it, I, I, I need it, god damn. Oh my fuck, <gasps> this one grew, our first trade grew. Oh, hell yeah. I think it looks ass. Get a nice little jungle tree, go in there, place a couple leaves on the side. Make it kind of believable. We dead ass don't have any more fucking wood. Now I gotta go and, 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 and farm. The fuck type of shit. Now I gotta go to sleep. I gotta go to sleep now and then I gotta wait for it to turn morning while I sleep. And then while I sleep, I gotta wait when it's morning. I gotta go chop some trees down and then I gotta climb up the tree to get the rest of the wood. And I need some, I don't think I might need any more leaves, but I might, but you never know. Actually, I got like three stacks, four stacks, but I still don't want to chop trees down for a living because I got I got I got I got I got to leave it a fucking tree bro I don't I don't want to put I don't want to fucking break any more fucking trees bro yeah I'm liking the way this is turning out I, I actually might repent for my aggressive ways and my aggressive behavior towards this game all right all these trees are growing out now Oh my god, I feel like I've been working on this build for so long that I can't even remember if I was talking to myself or if I was actually talking out loud or if I was going insane and just thinking but not actually speaking. You know, sometimes as an artist you have to know when to step away, but I'm not stepping away yet. I don't think I've shown this yet, but I've, I've been working on this Well, I worked on it. The mine doesn't look this, that bad. This entrance and the pathway leading up to it, I really like this. But once you go down it, it kind of leads into like the ravine. Just gonna do a little, little adjustment up here. Just a, something slight, you know, something that um, you know, might help out a little bit. Not too much. Nothing too, too special. Well, that tree's grown. Not sure if it actually fits with the vibe of the rest of the tree, but it is what it is. It doesn't look that bad. If you don't think about it too much, it really doesn't look too bad. Oh, I just let out the nastiest, the nastiest sneeze, bro, and it, it left like a, a, a taste in my nose. Now, I do have a problem, and that problem is that I don't have many torches, so my main source of light is going to be campfires because I can't afford better lighting. Are these floors gonna be very unproportional? Yes, but that's what adds character to the house, to the home. That's what makes a house a home. It's like just the right amount of space, you know, have like a little starry night. I mean, you can't see the roof, but, I mean, you can see the roof, there are leaves, but you can't see outside the leaves through the, you can't see through the leaves into the night sky. You know, you can easily just look outside the window. Hey, you don't even need a window. Boom, you can see outside. Well, it's raining. But you can still see outside. You can have a little bit of a porch moment here. It probably would have made more sense to do this the first time. I don't know why I didn't think of this before. There's a creeper in a tree. I bet I could shoot it. I shot it. Look. Bro, I'm literally fucking green arrow, bro. Look, this is so vibes. I'm going fucking insane. Oh my. Top floor. Second floor. This one looks a little more mysterious and kind of creepy. And then the bottom floor. Still not sure what I'm going to do with this bottom part. 
probably gonna put some more campfires down here now what I'm really interested in is my wheat farm and it's not completely ready to be harvested it's only like seven or eight patches I haven't grown in it so we press this it sends a signal through the redstone to the dispensers over there with water buckets in them see the water comes down down here that did it get pushed all the way because of that little piece right there so that comes down through there the water gets absorbed again coming through here goes into the hopper now we have a bunch of seeds Well, folks, I think that's where we will be ending off today's episode. We've made a somewhat questionable structure. Maybe it looks better from the side. I don't know. I'm not going to go check. That's too far. Maybe in the next episode, we can look at it from some different angles. Because next episode, we're going to have to be going a little bit farther than where we usually are. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Make sure you subscribe. Super close to 100 subscribers. I'm really hoping to hit that by the end of this year. And I will check you guys out. Peace.